Hey guys, welcome to Quake 2. Quake 2 is a game I love. I think it's a great game. Um, if you've never played it, I highly recommend it. Um, so yeah, this is Mission 1, uh, Outer Base. And we need to establish communications and locate the installation elevator. Um, they tell you all the secrets and stuff in this. This is not going to be a 100% secrets run, just so you know. Uh, because I don't know where they all are. It's literally, I'm just playing the game to kind of have fun, so just, you know, bear that in mind. And if you always want to know who we're playing as, we're playing as Bitterman. That low texture. But yeah. Um, so, first things first. We're going to go get a shotgun. Because I love shotguns. But yeah, th th I mean, this is FPS gaming kind of at its finest, you know. It's, just, it's very simple, straightforward. Um, yeah, and it's pretty good. This uses the uh, id Tech 2 engine. I think at the time it came out, it was just known as the Quake engine. <laughs> so, uh... It was literally just known as the Quake 2 engine when it came out, but uh, it, it was later referred to as the id Tech 2. And if you didn't know, um, they actually used id Tech 2 to, uh... id Tech 2 to build uh, Half-Life. Um, a modified version. I mean, they, they did modify it themselves and put in some extra stuff. But yeah, I mean, so potentially without Quake 2, we would have no Half Life. And Half Life is obviously another game that's fantastic. So I'm just using this as a flashlight because, you know, the ability to see is quite nice. You also might be able to tell I am running a few mods. Um, mainly just improved lighting, textures, and more importantly, to put the fucking music back in. Because, you know, why would you ever want to play this game without the music? Honestly. What the hell? Stop that. I'm aiming like a complete jackass. Ugh. So yeah, I'm not a fantastic Quake player by any means. Um, I get by, which is the main reason I'm playing on medium, which you can see there at the top. Because um, I'm playing this to have fun, and this is a very... Whoa, 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 hitching. Where did these guys come from? So, yeah, there there are some minor performance issues with this game. I don't get why. There's, there's no fucking reason for it. Um, it. It makes recording it hilarious amounts of fun. Like, I can't use uh, uh, Shadowplay, for instance, to record this, which is what my normally preferred uh, record method is, but Shadowplay just won't record this game. Um... So I had to use a different method, unfortunately, but, uh, you know, whatever, whatever, you know. Probably shouldn't have shot those barrels. Come on, where are you? Oh. We'll go have some fun with this guy. There we go. Grenades are fun and very dangerous. In fact, I'm not going to use them because they're that dangerous, honestly. So we're, we're just going to fall back on the old shotgun. See, as you see, we fucking probably missed out on so many secrets yet. Yeah. Oh yeah, I know, I know one I missed out on actually. Um, so, uh, see, I know where some of the secrets are, but uh, not not all of them. So I'm um, obviously is this one, which uh, it's pretty easy to find. But yeah, what was really great about uh, Quake 2 is it was kind of like the first id shooter to kind of, I say, have a storyline. But I mean that's incorrect because obviously you know Doom and both Doom and Wolfenstein, of course, had a, a storyline. It's just um, the gameplay was kind of forefront, and I would say the gameplay is forefront in this one too. To gain access to the sewer tunnels. Um, I would say the gameplay is forefront in this one as well. It's just. A little bit different because this game stop that this game actually has objectives um, that you have to complete and like it's see, with all the all the other games they did it was kind of just get to the exit you know find keys get to the exit kind of thing um, this one was completely different because you actually had to do stuff and it was really interesting because the the actual levels themselves kind of feel like non-linear and stuff which is obviously good because you know stop Cockbag. Oh my god, I hate I hate those machine gun guys. Hit scan enemies, bullshit. As, as usual, the worst kind of enemies are hit scans. Come on. 
Come on over here. Yeah, you can stop that and all. Oh, gib him. Good old gibbing. Some more ammo, more some health. Come and get you. But yeah, this is a good old, good old fun times. And I, I like the, uh, I say the lore of this game. What I mean is I like the enemy design, I like the idea of the enemies. They're basically the Borg, honestly. Um, they basically attacked Earth and we basically come here to kick them in the teeth. This is what it amounts to, like, you know, we managed to fight them off and, uh, then we decided we're gonna fuck these guys up because they're pieces of shit and we don't we don't like pieces of shit. So, you know. Oops. I'm not gonna waste too many grenades on each of these guys, because I like grenades. So I'm not gonna waste them. But yeah, this game has. It's it's just like it feels good to play, and it just the physics react well. I mean, you could argue it's just where I'm used to the game more than anything else. But um, no, it it just it it's a very tight game. So and secrets because you know secrets. Anyway, let's gain access to the sewers. I wonder if this is the sewers. See, I like the way they cope with the fact you're the only surviving marine. Like, uh, you would have seen it in the intro cutscene, but um, you're the only surviving marine. I mean, there's marines on the planet, and the Strog are doing wonderful things to them. We'll see all that later. But I, I mean, they're just a nice enemy. I find. Um, you can actually play a prequel to the game called Enemy Territory Quake Wars, which is... It was... I, I quite liked the game, it was just, um... It was just a kind of multiplayer shooter, though. That's the unfortunate, unfortunate thing. It's, and it was it was nice to see the attack on Earth as a guy up there shooting at us. Um... Take care of him. Pick up the rebreather because we need it. Pick up that. I need to select the rebreather. Where is it? There it is. Because we need to go down here because we're going to go get the super shotgun. If you didn't know. Yeah. The, the, I, I like the um, the subtle lighting mods and stuff I've got on this. They, I mean, you could mod the shit out of this game, but uh, obviously, it being a uh, an older game, it, it tends not to perform too well when you mod the crap out of it, unfortunately. So I've come con from for like kind of like a balance. Yeah, we need to locate a powerful weapon. It's a super, it's a super shotgun, guys. It's a super shotgun. That's how we do. You reckon Superman would use the super shotgun? Probably. Maybe it was named after him. I mean, it's a fucking double barrel. I don't know why they call it the super shotgun, but I mean, whatever. I mean, to each their own. This you know, store opens elsewhere. I, d I have no idea to ever. I've never found how to open that door, just so you know. So just, uh, you know, bear that in mind. Ow. That wasn't so good. Doesn't matter, we got health out of it anyway. Um, I mean, it's got some good old jump maneuvering and stuff. Sorry if you can't see anything here, I'll try to rectify that quickly. Just, uh, you know, do that. That's unfortunately how you got to deal with it, I'm afraid. Get on our train. I mean, I, 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 I like a train. I mean, this game had a lot going for it. Had a lot going for it. Uh, uh. Hey, 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 hey. And the shotgun is a proper shotgun. It has decent fucking range. I mean, it does have spread off, but it is not as drastic as some, uh, 
as as some are. It's a very very nice feeling shotgun, you know. And it's it's really odd when you think about it because you know the shotgun of Doom was very good, right? Doom had a great shotgun. Quake had a great shotgun. Quake 2 had a great shotgun, and then when Doom 3 came out, they decided, you know what? We've done good shotguns for too long. Let's make a really shitting pile of wank one. You know, just to annoy people. Because, you know, it's, people like crap guns, right? I like grenades. They're, they're fun. If you wonder why I keep... Just, just in case you've never played this game, which I don't know why you wouldn't have, because it's amazing. Um, if you're wondering why sometimes I duck around the corner after I kill an enemy, it's lich. It's literally because some of the enemies in this game, while they're in their death thralls, they decide, you know what, I don't like you, so I'm gonna kill you. And they'll do like a kind of muscle spasm thing where they fire. I mean, it's explained in the instruction manual. Um, just so you know, these big dudes with the chain guns that I don't really like too much. They're uh, called. <laughs> yeah, just so you know, I was more than a little bit aware that the grenade was about to blow up on my face, but I was trying to aim the shot, and I'm just like, Ugh. that's okay. I'll take the damage. I'll take the damage here. In fact, I'll save. Um, Oh, not these guys. These, I hate these guys as well. But yeah, I mean, I like I like the enemy design. I like the weapon design. Um, I hate whatever that enemy is. Where is he? Where are you? He's around. I can hear him. I just don't see him, and that really that always bothers me. Not really built for range, the old machine gun, but whatever. There he is. There we go. Now where are you? I hate the flyers. The flyers suck. They're, they're heavy amounts of shit. So I'm gonna say I'm gonna save scum a little bit in this game because I don't I don't like redoing stuff. Um, I know it's not been the spirit of things people may argue, but uh, that's that's okay. Oh, he dodged. He didn't dodge that one though. I pick up the health, pick up the shotgun. Yeah, and whenever we complete an objective. Um, the music stops. I can't remember if that's in the game, default game at all. A A A A. A. But you still know uh, this game does have sliding mechanics. Like I was sliding down that hill. A little bit irritating, but you can deal with it. Bullets. Well, it's always good to uh, like hunt for stuff to a certain, certain, certain extent. Like I said, I don't know where all the secrets are in this game, um, so if you're triggered by people missing stuff, then this is not the LP to watch. This really is not the LP to watch. I'm literally playing for all the fun times. Because this game is fun times. And he ate shit. Hey guys. Nice to meet you. Hope I, uh, you know... Hope you weren't too bothered by the fact that I just gunned you all down in cold blood. Oh, I hate these guys. Oh, you know, it's waste so much fucking ammo. I, I really dislike the flies. <laughs> they suck. But now, nah, there are actually secrets here as well, if I remember correctly, so we're going to go try and get those. Any problems is these guys. And I think I just activate the switch. I don't know what I activated though. Um I hope it isn't on a timer. Probably it probably is, honestly. 
Oh, maybe it was this. Or was it you? You aren't activated by Switch, are you? I hope not. Oh, I hate right, Well, we're going to go back down into the water so we can see what's this way, if anything. Single barrel chocking on there. Oh, not on you, though. Oh, my God. I hate those guys. Die, please. Oh, no, not the dogs. Huh. Ain't going down there. Is there an elevator button? Nah, no, screw that. Whatever. We're just gonna get out of here. Cause it sucks. Actually, I think I know where that goes. I think I know where that is. Been so long since I've played through this game. Sorry about the lack of music now, but you know, not much I can do about that. I'm gonna quick save before I do this. So I don't know. Ah! Wow. That's awkward. <laughs> I didn't expect that to happen. That was pretty good though. So yeah, be aware that elevators absolutely suck in this game. Oh my god. Not as much as these guys, though. Right. And I just started drowning there. And this, yeah, this takes me back here. Okay, right, well, that was kind of a waste of time. Um, honestly. I would, I would and I could reload, technically. But you know what, this, I'm not going to do that. Because, you know, that, that feels a bit like... Oh, can I get out of the water, please? See, this is a problem with the water sometimes. You get this kind of crap going on. There we go. I know we have to wait for our ride. Hooray. This game's almost tranquil with no music going on, isn't it, honestly? Almost tranquil. We're going this way, though. Why is this, this elevator not making a noise now? I don't know why that thing was not taking any damage either. Like I said, flyers are the worst. Uh. Everything's the worst. He tried to end my day. I wasn't letting him do it though. Is there any health around here? Did I leave any health around? Probably not. I was probably an idiot and ate it all. Oh, you are a cock. Uh, we're gonna use machine gun. Use machine gun because you know it's the easiest way. So how do you get up there? S seen that area before? Hmm. Oh well. No health. I guess we gotta go back to the main mission with 76. That's not too bad though. Like I said, there's, there's a reason I'm playing on playing on normal because it's just. Oh, they say normal's the way the game's meant to be played, so. So that's that's what we're gonna what's what we're gonna go with. I like challenging myself on the odd occasion, but I'm just super rusty, honestly. Super rusty. And I got whatever was here. Save. Just because you know what we need is. Hate dogs. Dogs suck. Fetch. No, 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 no. Stop it. Stop it. 
So these guys eat your health like in seconds. They literally suck you dry. They they they're the worst. I hate them. I hate them. They shouldn't even be in the game. You hear me? You shouldn't even be in the game. You you suck. Anyway, crisis averted. I didn't really take any hits from that guy. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do that, and there's reasons. Oh come on! Stop that. Why are you like just running on the spot? Right, there's a reason I didn't want to shoot that guy because I knew the shotgun spread would have uh, blown these up, and I want to get this. So yeah, there we go. We have quad damage. And I fell down the stairs, but it's okay because I was able to take care of him. So it's kind of beneficial in a in a weird kind of way. There we go. I quite like mixing up the super shotgun and the uh, standard because I don't really like. See, on these guys, it's pretty terrible wasting the ammo, honestly. But uh, I mean, sometimes they take two shots, D depending on depending on where they are, obviously. Hit scan enemies. Everybody loves hit scan enemies. If you don't know what a hit scan enemy is, then you don't know you don't know what true pain is. Um, so some weapons in games are projectile based, like your weapon actually fires like an actual solid object that hits entities. Uh, hit scan just basically detects if the, uh, the thing is pointing at the enemy and detects whether you hit it or not. So hit scan enemies are kind of bullshit because they can they can basically always hit you is the problem. Like anything in this game that uses bullets is pretty much a hit scan enemy. So just, you know, bear that in mind, fortunately. Example of his stupid, like, suck your dry attack. Stop that. Where is he? Screw you. Oh, well, he wasn't too much of an issue. Right, now we're going to establish the communications, which is this dish here. This is what we've been trying to do. And we're going to pick up the keycard. Yeah. As you can see, it's to enter the uh, bunker installation. So that's, that's what we're doing now. I like, I like this game's sense of progression, and like. It's not coming across right now, but these maps, like, you can just pretty much go everywhere. Like, they, they open up later on. I mean, s some have loading screens in them. And they're very large. Uh, are very large maps indeed. But, like, th that's what I like about this game. It, ha it has, like, a very, uh... Hang on, what am I doing? I almost forgot this. There's a reason we did that. We want this. And we want this. But we also don't want to die from the, uh... Toxic order, so yeah, we'll go with that. I find um, the machine gun to be really useful for these guys, honestly, because they kind of stagger slightly. Oh, oh god! Stop that! I took two birds with one stone there. I love that. What's the wooden what? kill any resistance. Well, I mean, I, I, I've kind of been doing that already. You don't need to tell me, honestly. It's just what I've been doing, you know? It's what I've been doing. Oh, there we go, some more music. We'll do that. Hey. Yep, yep, yep. Ah! <laughs> that was kind of funny. Oh, not these guys. Go, we just go down here. Ah, could have gone better. That works, though. 
So the flyers are another enemy that can like take care of you reasonably quickly if you don't take care of them first. I mean, but you know, every enemy has that kind of advantage, I guess, if you when you think about it. But they're giving us a lot of shotgun ammo, so right, we're going to save here because I know what's coming. Right. We have grenades too. Sweet. And we get another quad damage. So we could have used one there. I, I think it's intended that you're supposed to, but uh, I mean, it just seems like kind of a waste to me, honestly, you know. Um, anyway, we're going to go down here in, in the dank basement, because we like dank basements. Um, yeah, it's like that. There's, I know there's dudes down here. These corridors. It's corridor shooter. It is Call of Duty, guys. We're playing Call of Duty. The only thing's missing is the regenerating health. Okay, we can go back up here. I think that's it. I think we're out. We probably missed secrets. Oh no, we got both of them in this map. I'm, oof, wasn't even trying on that one. Anyway. So yeah, this this was that was mission one, you know, and good way to start off the game. I'm obviously obviously I'm really familiar with this mission, so yeah.